Hey babe. Yeah. You ready to go to Europe? I'm ready. Let's do it. I think we're about ready to go. Got three bags each, all of which probably overweight, but fingers crossed, we got through okay. See you at the airport. Later on. All right, made it to BART. Already had some tribulations here most crazy traffic we've seen coming from our route. I think there's like a big accident or something. So anyway, parts here. Next step. Now. This is a yellow line train to San Francisco International. Super loud on BART per usual, but we made it. All we have to do now is sit until we get to SFO. And we should be solid. Classic San Francisco, super hot, probably like 85 degrees where we were coming from the East Bay. Get through the tunnel and it's crazy foggy. Probably like 50 degrees over here. So I think we're just about to SFO. We have to get back to lugging all these bags around. Fingers super crossed that we can check these bags without an issue. Yeah, we'll see what happens. Got everything off the seats. International terminal. Moment of truth for these bags. My bag is good. Now what about cannabis? Let's go, let's go. It's so heavy. All right, we're through security. Well, I am waiting for Kenna. For some reason, they didn't put TSA pre-check on her boarding pass, but actually pretty painless. We had to pay, I think it was like 170 for oversized luggage, but not the end of the world. So we got let's see, about an hour until we board, so I think we're going to hit one of the lounges. Hello, welcome to the No lounge in this terminal, classic, but ordered a beer, glass of wine, and some food. Hopefully gets in here in time. Literally sweating, stoked for this beer. First one of the trip, so cheers up. What'd you get? Inhaled that burger and crushed that beer. Grabbing some snacks now at Napa Farms Market. And then heading off to our 11 hour flight. Might have to rethink this bag layout. My camera bag back here is literally, feels twice as heavy as this giant bag. So right now it's slung over my shoulder, which is super stupid, but whatever works. Does anybody else wonder why they have Gucci in the airport? I'd love to see the person who's casually stopped at Gucci to pick up something on the way to their flight. Maybe in the future. Hello, how are you? Good, how are you doing? Good. <sighs> Almost there. So close. So done carrying this bag. Somehow this is the most efficient way for me to carry everything. Hello, welcome to We made it. Literally feels like we just got on a plane to like Bangkok. It's a thousand degrees in here.
freezing in first class. But let's have it back here. That's Swiss entertainment. Entertainment. Kilometers. What do I do with that? Ooh. All right, we've officially taken off. A little bit of a tight squeeze in here. It's not too bad. I think we might upgrade on the way back out though, because it's pretty tight. I don't even know a year because it doesn't say. It's not bad. I don't mind it. Opted for white because I'm afraid I'll probably spill the metal of myself as is tradition. It's a drink. I need more wine. Pretty tight in here. Just ate dinner. It wasn't too bad. But it's literally like we just spent probably half an hour trying to find this face mask. I could like barely bend over and I needed to get something out of the bag. It was just an absolute disaster. <laughs> but I think I'm fully set up. Got my sweatshirt, got the neck pillow, got the mask. Gonna try to pass out. Godspeed. Well, just got served breakfast. Passed out for a couple hours, but somehow I managed to lose my eye mask again and one of my AirPods, driving me nuts. But at least there's food, got some good sleep. Might have to wait on the airplane a little bit after to find all this stuff. On the bright side, this croissant looks pretty good. Must find AirPod. Officially disembarking. Wow, these seats up here look a hell of a lot more comfortable. The Eagle has landed. Not the most comfortable flight, but Honestly, it went by pretty fast. I think I slept most of it, watched some of a movie. I don't even think I finished the movie. We're here now, do a little custom check, and I think uh, hopefully my boy Dimitri should be here to pick us up. Stoked. Last time. Next departure to gates A, B, and D. And B, E. You feel alive to see the dish flow. Don't work too hard, I break the back though. Return to the back, the kick is back though. Cove and the cash, I never lack those. She saw the stone, you know how that go. Fatality, my diamonds that cold. Versace trucks, I hit my back stroke. Knock on the door. Look here. Just waiting on the D. The dirty deed me tree and then we'll be on our way pretty excited to be off that plane stretch the legs it was hot as hell in there the whole time i think i've managed to get a little bit of sleep can't say the same for ken over here lost my eye mask and my airpod like 50 times just struggling to fit in there <laughs> but we made it so it's all good so, yeah so uh not really sure which way we're supposed to go now Back, 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 boring? back. So we left at eight o'clock, San Francisco time, about an 11 and a half hour flight. And it is looking like a little past 5.30 after bags. And um, yeah, so just gonna go find Dimitri and we'll be on our way down to Neuchatel. I think it's like a two hour drive. A little exhausted, but also just amped. So we're meeting up with one of my best friends from high school 
before high school, I think middle school, who is now a resident Swiss. So about to give us the lay of the land. Just waiting, I think he went to the wrong terminal, so we'll see which way he goes. Done made it! Room to bring stuff back. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have to get another bag if we wanna bring any more stuff back. Oh my lord. Got some welcome uh, gifts from the D. Servla, classic. Yeah, yeah. And some classic French. French? Some no, classic French. Swiss God chocolate. Damn, we're right, get out of here, go back! <laughs> some classic Swiss God chocolate. <laughs> Nothing goes together French like Servla and chocolat. <laughs> This is a hot dog <laughs> mayonnaise salad with them. I'm sure you have a custom made playlist just for this trip. Spring comments. All I really take is a little taste. I like girl blue eyes with a little base. Here for the thrill, I don't need a chase, sir. Wanna vibe it to get away. Shimmy, so shimmy, yeah, from to Zurich down to Nuchatel. What is that, like an hour and. <laughs> like an hour and 45 minute drive? Stop you there. Two hours and 30 minutes. And three hours of travel. Well, okay, well, appreciate you picking this up. Oh, no problem. <laughs> Gonna go stop and get some classic, traditional Swiss cuisine. That'll be awesome. In the meantime, holding it over with some chocolate delivered by the Swiss man himself over here. There's about another hour in the car. We're feasting. Limousines, really think I'm seeing things. Read the line in mid between. Tell a light, I gotta speed up. Get home to a cold shower. Need that. A little self service. Early eating. Stop it. I'm so through with this. <laughs> Unsuccessful to stop at the self service, but it was fun for the experience. There'll be more serve loss. So we've rendezvoused with some new friends, some old friends, and we're about to go head up to a nice, good old-fashioned Swiss mountain day. Oh, This is the specialty of the Michetel Canton. It's absent. They just like all about it. So they uh yeah, wait. We have to add water to it. <laughs> See how it milks up. So all of our trips here guys. Alright, I got some traditional Swiss meal here. Their own way of doing it. It's not hash work. Her hands were just all over that thing. Just like, yeah. I was like, whoa, it's crazy. Yeah, really. Oh, we can move that to the back. <laughs> These cows. So that live music we're was completely off the cuff. The table next to us asked if they could play some music. So we didn't cool. realize they meant play some music. Froggy, froggy. <laughs> what a day. We made it to our final destination for the day. <laughs> final destination. <laughs> oh man. 
That was a journey. What a day. I can't believe we woke up and crossed the world. Yeah, right? Well, we have officially made it. That was a heck of a journey. Waking up in San Francisco, dealing with a bunch of traffic, long BART ride, long flight, all the things. But made it to Switzerland. Excited to be here and uh, pretty epic. Uh, welcome dinner with some live music that was unexpected and just like traditional Swiss food. So we're both exhausted. I think we're gonna pass out and nighty night. Good times.